Thank you, Andy. I'm really happy to be here. I'm standing up here looking at all of you, some of the world's best technologists at one of the biggest technology conferences of the year. And I know you're wondering, what's the head of a bank doing here? Well, the world's changing. You just saw the CEO of Goldman Sachs DJ in Las Vegas, and not for the first time, I would say. But let me tell you a little bit about how we're using cloud technology to change our business. Goldman Sachs is a financial services company. We provide advice, we lend and invest money, we make markets, and we manage risk. We stand in the middle of a market with trillions of dollars of flows. We advise on hundreds of M&A transactions a year and underwrite millions of stock and bond offerings. Ultimately, we help our clients achieve their financial goals. We care deeply about our clients' goals because they aren't intangible, abstract things. They are real-world problems. And everything we do, from simple lending to complex derivative trading, serves a real purpose, like helping you renovate your kitchen or finance your expanding contracting business. Finance is as simple as that, or it should be. The reality of it is, finance is much more complex, and Goldman Sachs' job is to try to simplify it, to make it as easy, intuitive, and as effective as possible. How do we do it? In-house, we have around 9,000 engineers who make up about a quarter of our 38,000-person workforce. We have some of the best engineers in the world working on some of the most interesting problems. And everything we are building is trying to make finance work better. Cloud technology allows us to do our job in a way that's simple, all while accounting for the complexity of our industry and helping us ensure that our work is safe, secure, and responsible. While we work with a few cloud providers, AWS was the first because their immense capabilities and the astounding pace of their innovation. A few years ago, my colleague Roy Joseph was on this stage here to talk about how we work together to develop the Bring Your Own Key solution for AWS's key management services, a crucial data privacy development that's allowed us to fully, as an organization, embrace the cloud. Not to be too on the nose, but AWS's cutting edge approach to technology really unlocked something for us here. Since then, we've been busy with the help of AWS building predominantly cloud-based businesses. I want to talk to you about a couple of those for a few minutes here today. The first is our credit card business. In conversations with our clients, we realize that the credit card could be a much simpler thing, and it could provide consumers with a new way to relate to their spending. Repositioning the credit card is a tool that was truly on your side. Building the credit card platform that underpins Apple Card took a number of our engineers, as long as, as, along with a very strong partnership with Apple, MasterCard, and of course, AWS. It would have made sense for us to get into the business if we had to maintain fields and fields of on-prem data centers to do it. The only reason we were able to deliver these capabilities digitally and at scale is because of cloud technology. Apple Card launched just a few months ago, and it's already one of the most successful credit card launches ever. It's part of Marcus, our digital consumer banking business, which today is just three years old. Although we're a 150-year-old company, we're still new to consumer finance, but I think it's pretty clear that we're onto something. Today, through Marcus, we have $55 billion in retail deposits and millions of clients. We're putting cloud technology to work in other areas of our business as well. Big companies make trillions of dollars of payments every day. But right now, this space is dominated by legacy architectures, manual processes, and slow turnaround times. Next year, we'll launch our transaction banking service, a digital platform that helps corporations manage their cash built entirely on a cloud-native stack provided by AWS. Goldman Sachs is already using it to make billions of dollars of our own payments in five currencies every day, providing us enhanced transparency, trackings around our cash flows, while saving us a lot of time and money in the process. 
We're eager for our clients to experience this service and look forward to sharing more details about our rollout plan next year in 2020. Historically, financial technology has been powerful and fast, but it's lagged behind consumer and high tech in terms of elegance and simplicity. If you want a bank account, you have to wait for your funds to clear. If you want a loan, you have to wait for approvals. If you would want advice for your company how to better manage your balance sheet, you have to send an email and ask for a meeting. It doesn't have to be this way. We can do better, but we're not there yet. Finance is the perfect place to take new technologies and have an immediate real-world impact. Our data scientists have been using AI and machine learning techniques for years, and we're already pushing the research community to consider what's possible when you apply quantum power, quantum computing power, to financial problems. While Goldman Sachs serves corporations, governments, institutions, and individuals, we're also building for developers. The same way you go to AWS for their best-in-class cloud services, we want to be your first choice to provide services that enable you to build financial functionality directly into your applications and workflows. Already, for our institutional clients, we're making the capabilities of our powerful securities database available directly through a platform called Goldman Sachs Marquee. The real power of Goldman Sachs Marquee lies in the scalable services you can access directly through our APIs. We've published some of our APIs on developer.gs.com, and we will continue to add more over time. Our clients already use the power of AWS to access a number of these services. We're migrating production of Marquee to AWS, and starting next year, we'll be delivering new products and services to our clients there directly. My goal is for Goldman Sachs to lead the way in building financial services technology, and we're going to succeed in no small part during the work we have done and will continue to do with Amazon Web Services. Still, our job will remain the same, to assume the burden of complexity and make finance as easy, intuitive, and as effective as possible. We want to enable you to focus on building things that we couldn't dream of, things that change the way the world works for the better. Because sure, finance is complex, but it should never be a drag on innovation. Like AWS has been for Goldman Sachs, finance should only ever be a business accelerant. I look forward to seeing what we can build together. Thank you all very much for having me. Have a great day.